Throughout her reign, Queen Elizabeth II made seven visits to Tasmania. Let's take a look at some of the highlights through the decades. In her first visit to Australia in 1954, the new Queen included Tasmania on her itinerary. She was the first reigning monarch to set foot on Australian soil. And in the island state, she visited the historic Marina wool growing station Connorville in Cressy. 14 years later, the Queen touched down again in the country's southernmost state, with locals mesmerised by the presence of royalty. And the Queen seemingly captivated by what the Apple Isle had to offer. Seven years later, and 23 years into her reign, Hobart welcomed Queen Elizabeth once more. Part of the Silver Jubilee tour, children came from as far away as King Island to catch a glimpse. There were two visits in the 1980s. And as with all royal visits, there was a lot of variety. From the Domain Athletics track in 1981 to commemorating the Anzacs in 1988. It shines a light on the greatness of the human spirit. Later appraising the local crayfish in Burnie. Her final visit to Tasmania was at the start of the new century. Your Majesty and Your Royal Highness, welcome to Hobart. Despite the passage of time and how much society had changed, she still delighted the crowds. Always remembered by many Tasmanians. Katri Uibu, ABC News. Queen Elizabeth II was only 20.